Hi everyone, I'm really excited about Autogen. Today, I'm going to take you through step-by-step step, the beginner's guide to run an Autogen project. So let's get started. First, we are going to use a virtual environment. For that, we are going to use Conda. If you want to download, you can directly download from Conda on Google. So type Conda create minus n Autogen Python 3.11.0. That's the version I'm using. Now the virtual environment is getting created. Once after it's created, just type conda activate autogen. Now we have activated the virtual environment. First up, we're going to install pip install py py autogen. This will install the autogen package. Next, export the key. This is how you export the open AI API key and click enter. To get uh, open API key, go into open ai platform and then you can create that key once that is done now we are going to create a file called app.py in that file import autogen next create an assistant equals autogen assistant agent give a name to the agent let's say assistant next create the user proxy autogen dot user proxy agent we're giving a name to that user proxy now we are creating another one variable inside user proxy agent which is code execution config the reason why we created this because we want to set up set in which folder we want to save the programs so i'm giving work directory and it is i'm just creating a folder called coding that's it the initial setup is done now you can initiate a chat. So to initiate a chat, type in user underscore proxy dot initiate underscore chat, then give the assistant's name, and then you can give a message. Message equals create a snake game and save it in a file. That's it. Everything is done. So it's just literally importing autogen, creating assistant, create user proxy, and initiating the chat. Now we are going to run Python app.py. Now this is creating a snake game and it is saving it in a file. Let's see what's happening. Now you can see the interactions and I'm going to click enter to proceed further. So you, you can see the code here, enter. So now you can see there's a folder called coding which got created and there's a snake game. The code is inside the snake game. So this code is iterating itself to check if there are any errors and it will automatically fix those errors and give us the code. That's it. Now let's try running the code. So that's Python coding slash snake game. Enter. So you can see the snake game there. Yeah, as simple as that. You can improve from here. And you can even try many other games from here. So yeah, that's it. If you like this video, do like, share and subscribe. Thanks for watching.